Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks, and tonight's video is about the object property docker. Properties docker. Docker. Anyway, if a customer sent you, and I, I very seldom use this, but I'm going to start using it more. Uh, customer sent you this text, and you're trying to match it up. I mean, that's we all do it. This is a text. It's a curve, and you can't find out what text it is, and they don't know what text it is. So you try to match it up. So you, you write the word tech and then you go up and your cursor down. But what has happened, it's it's covered up our word we need to see. So you do what I do many times and you know reduce it, bring in your mag, uh, zoom tool and get it kind of over the left or the right. Do the same thing. But it's still kind of covering up that T. Well, there's a way around it with the object property docker. Let's zoom in here a little bit. So I've made them both pretty big. Go up to Windows, Dockers, Object Properties, and here's all your fonts right here. So all you have to do is just cursor down this, and they're out of the way, they're to the right. Um, this makes life a lot easier. And there's a lot more things you can do with this um, Docker. I don't use it that much, but you could, you know, change the the fill, change the outline. Uh, you know, there's a lot of things you can do with it. I mean, it has no outline. You can put an outline around it, change the outline to red. You know, right here. Let's take the fill away. And there you got it. Now you can do the same thing with your colors and your no fill, but that's pretty cool. I think I'm going to do a little research and maybe go over this a little bit more, but this will be very helpful if you're trying to match up fonts. Uh, let's go back here and put it back to a text. And as you can see, it's just, they're out of the way and you can look at each one of them individually and got them pretty big on the screen. Hope that helped a little bit. Thank you for watching.